Hey everybody, this is GliderCat and it's time to play. We are back in Cryofall. Just going to clear out a couple trees here, then we're going to get to sorting through our inventory and seeing if we can't get that farm plot built. Let's go and take this down. All right. Lumbering level two, three. Let's see if we can build that farm plot now that we got the sand. Build. Farm plot. Build. Hmm, can this be outside of our range? You can place the structure only inside your land claim area. Hmm, not crazy about that. Let's put it next to our bed. Can we walk around this stuff? I guess. Boom. Boom, boom. Do three of them for now. And I've got some kind of seeds. Plant any seeds. Let's see. I must have to put those in my hands. We've got tomato seeds. And we're going to probably be able to kind of spawn more of these. Okay, let's pop down the tomatoes. Okay, harvest in three hours, basically four hours. Not watered. And I get my water can. Let's put that in the hot bar. And see if we can fill it here. I don't know if we can or not. Uh, I did fill up our little water jar. Let's see if this will uh, fill up the water can. Where are you? Empty bottle. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> How do I fill this guy up? Okay. Click on a well or water collector to refill it with water. Okay. So let's put this in here. Boom. And then select it. And then do this. Primary click. Boom. Okay, that filled it up. And maybe primary click here. Okay, watered for an hour. Improves the growth speed by 100%. Okay, now let's harvest in two hours. So we're going to have to water it again. Let's fill up the water can. And just see if they let me water it twice. I don't think they're going to. Yeah, no, they're not. All right. Um, let's go in here. Let's dump off the water can into storage. Let's dump off. We've got this rot. That's my inventory. Let's dump some stuff off here. We got more of this oil plant. We don't know what to do with yet. We've got some bones. Pop those in the stack. Animal fat. Uh, we did make something out of this. Can't remember. I'm gonna pop that in. We can eat for sure. Eat up some of these mushroom meals. Violet berries. I don't know what we can do with those. So I'm gonna throw a pile of rot in here. Maybe there's some use for that. We've got four leather. We've got some raw meat to cook. Let's do that. Uh, we'll throw the raw meat in and then do apply matching recipe. Take these this stuff out. I'll grab this charcoal. Let's make sure we're still doing copper if we can. Keep this furnace running. Do I have any copper ore? I do. Pump that in. We'll take the ingots. I'll dump the sand into the inventory and eventually we'll make glass from that next, but we'll let the furnace kind of work on the copper for now. Let's look at our craft table, see what we can make. Okay, an oil lamp. Portable light source and a convenient package can quickly be refilled with camp fuel. It's not urgent. Iron axe, we don't have the iron yet. Copper mace, we got lots of copper. Why don't we try that? Impact damage, attack rate. Does this show us kind of what we get? Damage, armor piercing, and attack rate. We're like halfway there, halfway to max on damage and armor piercing and three quarters on attack rate. Let's see how that compares to the knife. Hmm. Doesn't have armor piercing. Let's build one of these copper maces. 
we've got the resources to do it, and maybe it unlocks some little uh, achievement for us too. Paper, wood planks, iron toolbox, torches, hunter's tools. I don't know what the heck that's all about. Bundle of useful hunter's tools makes looting any creature much quicker. Uh. Hmm. Not worried about the speed so much. Glue. We saw this from the bones. We can make that here, huh? Why don't we do that from the bones we've got? I'm going to grab these bones. We'll do a little crafting and a little organizing. So let's do glue. Oh, I can't. It takes more than just uh, bones. Ooh, I wonder if it's going to chew up my jar too. Pure sulfur in powdered form. I don't have it and don't know how to get it yet. So let's dump those bones off. Can't do that right now. Put this club in the hot bar. We need new tools. We need steel, right? We should smelt some of this iron. Let's change the recipe out on this guy. Iron. Can we not smelt iron? Iron ingots. Select. Grab the copper. And hopefully that'll switch over to iron. I'd like to get... Yeah, I'd like to get some iron tools. We're going to need a bunch of wood planks. How are we doing on those? Not great. We've got 60. Let's... Oh, can I craft those here faster, maybe? Max. Let's do it. Let's get that going. Meanwhile, I'm going to take my axe that's about to fall apart. Chop some wood. Item broke. Oh, here's me trying to do it with my hand. <laughs> Alright, did they just toss that straight into my inventory? Looks like they did. Yeah, we've got a bunch of boards now. Good, good. And iron axe. We just need the iron ingots. We might have some ready. Two. I think we need at least one more. We'll wait for this last guy to smelt up, and then we can get an iron axe. And then maybe try and do the same thing with the, um, with a pickaxe. Move to iron, rather than making more stone ones. Let's grab that iron, come back up here, boom, raft. Rowbar, that's kind of cool. Not much in the way of an armor, right? We can only do the cloth. Maybe we need to unlock. I thought we did unlock the other stuff. Let's look at the, um, at the top of the screen here, the completionist milestones that we've met. Okay, we have cooked some meat. Boom. We found orange berries. We've roasted mushrooms. And we found violet berries. I think we're getting, yeah, we're getting a bunch of learning points for this too. Creatures. We've taken these guys all out. Some bug. Where's the little crab? Ooh, different kinds of snakes, it looks like, right? Okay. Loot. Loot. Garbage pile. And then this thing. Minerals pile. Nice. And then let's take a look at the skills. Anything here to learn about? This shows us where we're at. Tech tree. Level one, we've got totally researched. We've got 572 points. Chemistry, what is this going to allow us to do? So if you're a bunch of acids, fire logs, rubber, nitrocellulose powder, don't know what any of that's for. Construction, land claim tier two, that's going to allow us to expand our base. Iron crate, this isn't bad, right? Wooden barrel. <clears throat> Tinker table. Fire's duct tape. Electricity. 
Boy, all these things are kind of cool. Offense would be nice. Corn seeds. Let's research some of this farming stuff. <clears throat> that would take care of our food situation, probably. Uh, how much do you want for these? 20 learning points here, tier 2 for everything it looks like. Steel watering can, probably not totally necessary, maybe. Let's take these seeds. We'll see what we can do with this. In fact, let's just do all this. Two iron bars, is that... Oh, we ran out of fuel. Yeah, we want one more, and I think we'll be able to make the iron pickaxe at that point. Here's our water. We can walk up to this guy and just take a drink. And we get a full water bottle on us. Wondering if we should head over and try and use up our little stone axe here, or stone pickaxe, because we're going to get a good one, an iron one here in a minute. Let's uh, chew up some mineral deposits and use up this stone axe. We know there's more over by our old base here. We could take this. Oh, let's try our new uh, our weapon out. Well, I don't have much healing on me. Go take this snake out. Okay, that was two hits. All right. Let's loot these guys up. We're going to need to make more um, health potion stuff. But yeah, let's see. We're going to heal slow. I don't have any uh, stuff. For the guy at the top of the screen trying to get down to me. I'm going to have to run away from that. Whatever it is. I would like to get at the good ores. Hey, we're getting that sulfur powder we were looking for. Nice. Uh, this is just a collect it kind of thing. We don't have a whole bunch of life left in our pickaxe, stone pickaxe, but let's use it up. Ooh, what do I have here? Broken equipment. One or more of your equipment items has low durability and could break soon. Yeah, that's going to be the pickaxe here. That's all right. I'm trying to keep an eye on my health. It looks like it might be crawling up super duper slow on its own. Okay, we got a prospecting bonus just from doing it. Here comes our buddy. Alright, attempt fate here. Okay, our tool broke, so we can get out of here. Here's our old campfire. I tail it back to our new base. Pick up a few things on the way. All right, stamina's down. We need to make, we need to make healing potion if we can. Let's see, is that here? Blue, where do we make this kitchen, right? Down below. Wrong key. Herbal remedy. We can do it. Let's do the max, which is only two, apparently. There's one. I'm going to just uh, 
I'm going to use this. At least one of these I'll use. And then let's see how this is going. We've got 10 iron ingots now. All very good. I got food to cook. Let's go down here and cook some of that. Pop in the steak. Take this one down. And we can eat. So I'm going to go ahead and eat this guy and a couple of these maybe. Water, we can easily just take a sip over here. Drink. Let's see how our crop is doing. Okay, we're good for another 46 minutes. And then I'm going to water it again. What else was I going to do? Uh, what else? What else? We got tons of fibers. Why don't we craft some of this into rope? Like... I don't know just to get rid of it and then we can put this some of this rope into our storage along with this clay that we don't know how to use just yet rope we'll store it what else sort ores can probably both go into the smelter right and just be stored in here let's do that shift click those two in there how about sand Maybe not all the sand. There's something else I want to throw in here. What was it? I think it's ash. Sorts. We can store some fiber. Store the animal fat. Did that actually go in? Hmm. That we had more than four. All right. Sulfur powder. What was that for again? Let's see. Thought there was something we wanted to make. Now we want to make the iron pickaxe. We've got what we need to for that, so let's get that going. And then, what was it? Glue. Yeah, glue. Bones and sulfur powder. I've got just, yeah, I've got a lot, actually, sulfur powder. Let's see if we can make the glue. Grab these bones. And let's click the right button here and see if we can't make some glue. How much can we make? Just one, because we've only got one water container. Let's see if we lose that jar. Did we lose it? It looks like we do, right? Yeah, we got glue. We lost our jar. Uh, can we make another jar? We need broken glass. We got sand and we got a tiny bit of ash. Let's see if there's any more ash here. From one. Not much. Can these stack? We'll leave the coal there. Whoops, in the output. Tried to. Now it's not letting me drop it. Let's, hmm. Yeah, there's no recipe for ash. <laughs> I kind of wish we could just produce ash. Probably a way to do it. I'm not sure what it is. Let's put our new tools down. I didn't even realize we had a torch in the first slot. Let's move this guy over there. Health looks okay. Broken equipment. Not sure why that's still showing. Maybe our knife is weak. Just looking at things we can kind of craft here. Glue. Iron knife. Let's do that. We can use up our old one. Oh, uh, well, maybe we'll just throw that in storage. Now we just ditch it. There's a good one. Let's pop that down. So we've got a couple good weapons. Glass. 
this. Let's see if we can change the recipe. Buy the best recipe. Now we're making glass. I'll send in this last little piece of ash. We'll grab the iron out of here and they gave us another batch of glass. Let's go make another jar up here for water. That going. I think it's going to pop right into my inventory. So let's head down to the water collector. Pop that in here. And we can drink while we're here too. Grab that. That's all good. Okay, we got another ash. <laughs> I'm not going to collect this one by one. That's going to be a little too crazy, tedious. <clears throat> what else can we put in here? Let's ditch the leather, the potassium nitrates. I'll put the sulfur in for now and the bones. And let's see if we can get another storage chest. We did unlock the iron one, I think. Storage? No, not yet. Let's look at technologies. Tech two. Let's see, where would that be? Cooking, no. Construction, iron crate. Wood ingots, wood, wood planks and iron ingots. Let's do this. Land claim tier two. We gotta research this whole area just to get started, I think. Boom. And then this guy. Tinker table, let's do it. Steel crate and iron crate, I see. So steel's coming next. We can't produce that just yet. Wooden barrel, I wonder what this is for. Wood planks and rope. Let's unlock that guy. I'm not so worried about our fortifications. I don't think we've got people coming in to get us. Okay, let's take that broken glass and get back to doing iron. Got a charcoal I can dump off in there. Toxins, we can put that in storage. Let's see if we can build another bigger chest right below this one. Build iron crates. Build that down. Let's see what this guy's got. Uh, one more row, right? So eight per row. Yeah, it's just one more row more. That's fine. Uh, rot we've got in this container. Let's dump that off. Blue. What do we need for remedies that we can't make those? Do we have anything missing? Can we make more remedy? We're missing green herbs. How's that possible? Oh, red herbs. I see. So we need green herbs. Oh, man. Color blindness comes back to haunt me here. That's going to be hard for me to tell. I can't tell the difference between those two. Do a little exploring. Okay, what is this? This one, that's green. Let's take this guy out. Ooh, we took some damage here. Severe pain. Fine. Oops, I couldn't read it fast enough. Bleeding. You're bleeding, which will cause you to continuously lose health if not treated. Minor bleeding will go away on its own, but more serious injuries might require the use of bandages or hemostatic medicine. Looks like the um, intensity is going down, so I don't think I need to worry about it. Let's see what we get here. Is that green? Yeah. Oh, we got some bell pepper seeds. We can start another farm plot. 
don't want to fight right now. If I can help it. More green herbs, good. Got a rare pile of sand over here. Let's take it. Oops, is someone coming at me? No, it's just a chicken. Ooh, what, what is that sand? Okay, yep. A little different there for a second. Is that an herb? Red herbs. All right. They may have a different shape, too. Let's make some more medicine. I think we got some stuff, right? Max. Just one. Oh, what are we missing now? Mushrooms. How is that possible? I cooked them all up. Rust shrooms. Now that's what we need. See what we can find. Looking for mushrooms. That's penny bun, not the one we want. Get a little bit of ore here while we're out. There we go. So that might be the, the green one's a little more bushy, right? And then up here is maybe the red one. Can't tell based on the color, but the shape, maybe. Okay, yeah, that's the green, and I bet this guy is the red. Looks like a little tiny pine tree. All right, now I can kind of tell. We're going to avoid enemies as best we can. There's another green herb that'll do us for some uh, healing. Oh, and here's the mushrooms we need, right? Yeah, rust shrooms. We need these. Punch them over here. Nice. I like it. Avoid the snake. There's a red herb. So yeah, we're just kind of gathering resources this time. We do want to put down another farm plot here pretty soon. We got some new seeds. Let's check our inventory. How are we doing? Bell pepper seeds. We've got a few more slots in inventory, so we're okay to do a little more harvesting out here. Here's an easy wood pile we can pick up. Chickens, there's got to be a way to catch those. We'll find out. Oh, there's some more green herb. What do we get out of that? Coffee berries. I guess we can harvest one of these. Probably passing up some stuff here. Yeah, I am. Let's grab more of the herb. It's kind of important in those mushrooms. Ooh, this looks a little different. Is this sand? <clears throat> Excuse me. This is the clay. All right, let's see if we can make our way back to base. Where the heck are we? Oh, we're real close. We'll leave that water plant there. We'll harvest it when we need it. Back at base. Let's make some healing potion and then use at least one of them. Max, I can make three now. And I'll alt-click, use one for now. 
I got bones, I got rot, I got all kinds of junk. Clean that up. Let's put the bell pepper seeds in the hot bar and get those planted in a new plot that we can water. Seven, boom. Uh, grab our water can, I think it's in here. Where are you? I thought I put it in there. No, I got it on me. Let's see. Okay, water that. Water that. Let's go fill up the water can and we'll take a drink ourselves. And here, drink. We've got a jar of water on us, so we're in good shape with that. Food. Let's eat a little. Okay, that's all topped off. Our health is going to slowly climb up. It's at 74. We'll look in a second and just verify that it is actually slowly improving. I'll go ahead and dump the water can in here just for inventory space. Violet berries. I'm going to eat these. Just to get them out of my inventory. We've got more green herbs. What are we missing? We're missing more of those mushrooms and we could make more of that... Uh, Healing potion. Let's grab some. Got a few in view here. Might as well grab them. There's red herb. I'm going to let that stand since we're not really using the red herb yet. Might as well just keep it fresh. Leave it sit there. That is the wrong mushroom. Yeah, that's the penny bun. That's the herb we want. All right, back down at base. Let's start claiming some of these things we've done. Build a farm. 40 learning points. We'll take it. Craft better, better tools. We've already done it. We got the iron axe and the iron pickaxe. So we got an iron knife as well. Secure better water sources. Manufacture raw glass. They want us to do a little bit more glass refining. We just need to refine five more pieces. Do I have the ash to do it? Let's see. Gotta learn how to make ash. I know we're getting it as a byproduct in here, but there's gotta be a better way. A little bit faster way. So we'll pop the ash in. Boom. And we'll pop this little one piece of charcoal. We probably need to make more charcoal. And raw glass. This one little cycle should complete... Yeah, this... Oh, they want us to make five glass bottles. We've made two. We might be able to do that. Okay, manufacture raw glass. Okay, that is now satisfied. They want us to do three more bottles. Can we do it? No a problemo. Okay, good. <clears throat> Let's just see what it says here. To survive and thrive, you need easy access to large quantities of water, not just for drinking, but also for industrial purposes. Okay. You can easily find a variety of unlimited amount of sand. You can easily find a virtually unlimited amount of sand on any beach or shore. You can also find ash after burning wood and especially twigs. Okay. Glad we read this. So if we put twigs in for fuel, we might get more ash. That's going to help with the glass production. I have to remember that. Okay, you should always store a good amount for when you need it. Rather than using a water collector, you can also boil lake water to purify it and make it ready for drinking or for use in crafting. Okay, so we could take a jar over to the river, I imagine. Wells are much more effective than simple water collectors. All right, and you can boil salty ocean water to extract salt. Interesting. Let's fill up the bottles that we have, the jars with water, if we can. And then store them or something. There's one. Ooh. Okay, yeah, it fills as many as it can. Okay, cool. I like it. Drink. Let's 
Put two of those in storage. It's nice. These seem to stack, which is good. So we'll keep an eye on that. We have keep one of them on us. This glass... I don't think we need to hold on to it. Let's get rid of it. Got more of those oil plants. Let's ditch that. What else can we get rid of here? Bones. Fur. We've got collecting up in here. Glue. Not sure where we're going to use that. Let's put that down here. Fibers we'll hold on to. Let's ditch the ore. Get that into the smelter building here. Boom and boom. Play. I think we have over here. Let's get rid of that. Until we know how we're going to use it. Sort the inventory. Honey buns. Rust shrooms. We collected those so we could make more of that uh, healing. Herbal remedy. Let's... Oh, now we're missing the water plant. Let's go get some more of that. We know there's some nearby. I think there's a couple. Wasn't there one down here that we didn't harvest? We'll find one eventually. Let's take that and see what we can make out of it. We'll grab some ore on the way back. And then we'll wrap up this episode. Just want to make more of that healing remedy. Max. There we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And we're kind of naturally healing slowly. We're at 87. So yeah, this is a good stopping point. We can collect our reward here for the water. Okay. Yeah, we learned about burning the twigs. You got to remember that. It's going to be easy to forget. But burn twigs to get the ash faster. Claim that reward. Let's see what they got for us. Use a crowbar for destruction. Deconstruction. Being able to build anything is nice, but you might also want to know how to deconstruct your buildings. To do that, you can use a crowbar. As long as the building you are trying to deconstruct is inside of your land claim area, that is. This must get us our resources back. For purposes of this quest, you can deconstruct a section of the wall or something equally cheap so you don't lose valuable resources. Hmm. So they're implying that even if you use the crowbar, you are going to lose valuable resources. Hmm. You can only deconstruct buildings inside your land claim area. Okay. And deconstruction is the best way to remove any unnecessary or obsolete building or structure. Hmm. Okay. Explore biomes part one. Visit the forest biome, the beach, the lake shore, the meadows. We've done all of those. We just need to find tropical. Meadows have large numbers of bushes, herbs, and other useful plants. You can find many aquatic animals near the shore. All right, great. Okay, we've got a few objectives here. Not too bad. Biomes, crowbar. We'll do that next episode. Let's uh, slap in our last little bits of ore. And get this thing producing. Grab these iron ingots. Yeah, let's wrap it here. Next episode, we'll get back to doing the objectives. We cleaned up some inventory. We did some cooking. And we play, uh, placed down the iron crate. So we're making progress here. I kind of want to explore the biomes, and I'd like to see more challenging enemies. But we've got a whole bunch of stuff to unlock in the tech tree and armor and all that kind of stuff. Guns, all, all those things. So we got a ways to go. For now, this is Gladdercat saying thanks so much for watching. Special thanks to Gladdercat patrons and channel members. Really appreciate the support. And thanks to those of you that have been giving the videos a thumbs up. That helps my tiny channel grow, and I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you all in the next episode.